how does your educational philosophy integrate with technology to prepare students for future in silicon valley uh, so as i think i mentioned earlier you know we are a school that's always thinking about how we prepare kids for a world we can't yet imagine and so we've always been very tech forward mm. at the same time recognizing that um at the heart of great education are relationships right knowing that um you know we were one of the first schools in the world to adopt a one to one ipad program and you know this was you know 10 plus years ago which led to our apple, apple distinguished school recognition and led to a school that's been very um engaged in like finding different technologies more recently and i think in some ways like what's become a really interesting moment has been the emergence of ai mm -hmm. and we absolutely have do not know what to do exactly with ai yet. i would you know we you know we are trying to understand it but i think what we have done and i think this is very consistent with who we are um one of the people who helped create chat gpt came in and did a multi-part teaching um, lesson with students to talk to them about AI and the background of AI. Um, we've had several students, you know, kind of exploring AI, like what could I do with it? Um, and we haven't been like many schools. We didn't all like come out and say like, we're not going to do this. We're going to have rules. We're going to block it. We know that all of that is going to be important. Oh yeah. Like AI is very complicated and we know that there's things that are going to be really positive about it. And there's also things that are going to be negative, but, our stance is always one of like curiosity right? and it, you know, our, our core values are be kind, be curious, take risks, be your best. And like that curiosity like drives everything we do. And I think it makes us a school that is really receptive to technology. And that is also, you know, really understanding about how to do that in ways that are thoughtful. Check the full episode on our YouTube channel and on Apple podcast.